Now we come to the topic called electric potential and potential difference. Let us try to understand it this way. Suppose water flows, right? So for water to flow, what happens? Okay, what happens? Maybe I have a tank and I have a I am trying to take 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 water to this place okay let there be a tap kind of thing here so what happens what what drives the water there is a difference in height right fine the height difference drives water or moves the water, right? Moves water. Maybe if you are, if you could say that, see, there is a, there is a pipe from here through which I pump the water up. Is it not? You could be pumping the water from this level, okay, through maybe a tube well or something, okay. This you do due to how does that happen? Due to a pressure difference, okay, or the pressure difference drives water okay how does wind flow how does wind flow you'll find out hmm? sea breeze and land breeze what happens say there's water 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 here and say there is there is maybe trees here okay fine so this is land this is sea now what happens in the morning what happens the land gets heated due to the sun in the morning the land gets heated and the the land gets heated faster than the water so what happens this becomes a low pressure area so, so, so what happens due to heating? The, the air goes up and to take its place, the air from the ocean comes in and this goes up and this, this moves, since there is a vacuum here, so it moves there. This is called sea breeze. Why is it possible for us to have a sea breeze? Because, because of this pressure difference. There is a high pressure here high pressure here from where the from where the thing thing goes okay so this is a high pressure area high pressure area from there it goes to the low pressure area this goes to the low pressure area so so wind moves from wind moves due to pressure difference pressure difference right hmm? now say say this is a hot body it say hot hmm? this is a hot body 
Now anything in contact with this hot body, say this small body, what will happen? If I have say some water stored here and this is a hot body, what will happen? I will find that this water, the water that is stored here, that starts getting heated. Correct? So, so, so there is, there is the heat energy that flows from here to here, fine? And I will find, and, and that is our, our common sense says that all heat energy flow is from the higher temperature to the lower temperature. So, the heat energy flows from the higher temperature to the lower temperature. That is, it flows due to temperature difference. Do we get that point? It flows due to temperature difference. So, you see, there is a height difference there is a pressure difference, there is a temperature difference. So, whenever we have motion, whenever we have dynamics, okay, it is due to the difference of something, correct? Now, why am I doing all this in the chapter for electricity? Because I find my my electron moving from one terminal to the other terminal of the battery. And if I did not have the battery, if I do not connect the battery, I take the, I switch it off or I take the plug off, then I see there is no current flow. The current does not flow at all. Okay? So, there must be something. Okay? So, so what I am trying to conclude is, there must be, there must be something that is driving, that is, that is driving the electrons from one terminal to the other. Now, what is that? What is that? Okay. What, what is that which the battery is doing which is making the electron flow? Okay. It is the, it is the potential difference, it is the, hmm? the, that will, that will discuss, it is the potential difference It is the potential difference between the terminals that is making the electrons move, that is making the electrons move and that is making the electrons move and 
makes the current flow okay it is that which is making it move and that is what moves the electrons okay now though it is beyond our syllabus at this point i'd like to 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 go deeper into this concept of potential difference okay the potential difference and why a difference in potential will be able to drive electrons okay why the difference in potential will be able to drive the electrons okay 